Thanks for tuning in. I'm Karen Lair with a look at the top news headlines for Saturday, October 12th. Firefighters are known for helping the community, but Boise Fire Station 10 takes it to the next level every fall, turning their station parking lot into a pumpkin patch. They assemble a straw maze, set up a bounce house, and invite local families to come and make memories while raising money for community programs. All pumpkins are free with a donation benefiting the Community Assistance Fund, Random Acts of Kindness Fund, and the Toy Brigade bringing Christmas joy to patients at local children's hospitals. The fall festivities took over downtown Eagle this weekend with the Saturday Markets Harvest Fest at Heritage Park. It was a day filled with live music, mini horses, pumpkin decorating and competitions from local vendors and local musicians to local food and produce. Organizers say it is an easy way to embrace the local economy. Well, people from all over the Treasure Valley met up in Meridian Saturday to raise money and awareness for suicide prevention. The annual Out of the Darkness Walk encourages loved ones to share stories of family members lost to suicide while connecting the community with resources for suicide prevention. All money raised benefits the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention to invest in research, educational programs, and support for survivors of suicide loss. Meanwhile, mountain bikers took over Bogus Basin today for the Idaho Mountain Biking State Championship. More than 700 middle and high schoolers gave it their all after competing all season long. A big crowd also came out to watch that race, and instead of focusing on winning, they say their main goal is to instill a love of cycling in the younger generations. If you want to watch that full story, just head to 6 onyourside.com. Now, the On Your Side forecast. It was a beautiful day for some mountain biking, and it's going to be a beautiful evening for a football game. About 61 degrees by 6 p.m. Kickoff right around 8.15. 55 degrees, so cooling off into the mid 50s, but a mostly clear night. It's going to chill. It's going to be quite chilly by this evening around 11 p.m. About 45 degrees, so take your coat with you if you haven't headed out the door already. Sunday, we're going to get another big warm up. 64 degrees, partly cloudy skies going into Sunday. Another cool down coming to kick off the week. 62 degrees, but it won't last very long. 70 degrees going into Tuesday. That's right about where we should be this time of year. Partly cloudy skies sticking around through the end of the week. Mid 70s for the middle of the week. Wednesday we'll see a high of about 74 degrees right around Boise and then a big cool down by about 14 degrees going into Thursday. We've got a cool front moving into the region. Thursday we're expecting a high of about 60 with a good chance of some morning showers. Snow in those higher elevations going into Friday. That chance of showers sticks around at least through the middle of the weekend. 58 degrees on Friday and 50 degrees on Saturday. So we've got a bit of everything in this forecast. 74 degrees for the middle of the week and 50 degrees to end it.